What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Here we are with another reaction. In this we have India's Hyperloop Revolution, building the world's longest test track, the future of transportation. I'm excited because there's so much innovation happening in India. Um, that's absolutely fascinating to me. Um, and to be honest, I just love innovation like anywhere um to see things that i've never seen before uh and there's so many different countries doing so many different things and it's absolutely mind-blowing but india is doing so much with infrastructure with innovation right now as they're blowing up it feels like uh so i'm excited to see this before we do if you guys happen to enjoy please don't forget to subscribe get a video a thumbs up also if you'd like to support this channel by becoming a member all you gotta do is hit the join button to receive your exclusive benefits now let's dive in India is positioning itself as a global leader in futuristic transportation by building the world's longest Hyperloop test facility. After successfully completing a 422-meter test track in December last year, India is now preparing for a nearly 50-kilometer Hyperloop test track for evaluating the commercial feasibility. The under construction test facility. So, what is what exactly is a Hyperloop like? Is this something that a train's gonna go through? Like, I ain't calm me down. Like, I ain't never heard of a hyperloop before, so this intrigues me a lot. Facility will put India ahead in the race to develop the next generation of mass transit. Hyperloop can potentially revolutionize high-speed travel. Oh. This ultra-high-speed system, capable of reaching speeds of up to 1,100 kilometers per hour, will redefine travel as we know it. I need to look up. I need to look up the. Uh, hold on. I need to look up exactly how fast that is. Because that's crazy. One thing. I got to do it to miles because I don't understand kilometers well. Jeez, um, I don't know why I can't just... Oh. 684 miles per hour. That's unthinkable. To travel, not in a plane, that's, I don't know how fast planes go, but to travel that fast for 684 miles per hour. Y'all, I live like 12 hours away from where I grew up now. You're telling me, and something like this, had it been connected to where I am now, where I grew up. I'd be able to make that trip on this transportation in hour 15, hour and a half most, which takes me 11 to 12 hours to drive. That's insanity. That's mind blowing. Hyperloop is often referred to as the fifth mode of transport. It is a revolutionary system where electromagnetically levitating pods travel through vacuum tubes, eliminating friction and air resistance. This allows speeds twice that of aeroplanes with low energy consumption, zero weather impact and collision-free travel. Each pod can carry more than a dozen passengers. It can travel directly between two stations without any stops in between, thereby drastically reducing travel times. The 1500-kilometer journey between New Delhi and Mumbai could be completed in 90 minutes. Similarly, one could travel between New Delhi and Jaipur in India or between London and Paris in Europe in just 30 minutes. In 1799, an inventor, George Medhurst, proposed an idea to move goods through cast iron pipes using air pressure. First theorized in the 1970s by a Swiss professor, Marcel Hufer, the idea resurfaced with mass vision in 2013. Now, India is taking lead in transforming this vision into reality. India's Rail Minister Ashwini Vaishnav shared the news on X. He said Indian government is collaborating with academia on this revolutionary project it is funded by Ministry of Railways and developed at IIT Madras. The minister announced an additional $1 million grant. 
for the project. First part of 400. Oh, that's that's legit going to be insane, bro. I think of a world that we're going to live in 25, 50 years from now. It's probably going to look nothing like it does today. And that's fascinating and insane to me. Uh, 22 meters first tube this will really go a long way in developing the technologies i think uh, time has come when after the first two grants of a million dollar each the third grant of one million dollar will be given to iit madras for <laughs> further developing the hyperloop project in a nice way the Hyperloop concept was mooted by Elon Musk in 2013 when he proposed an ultra-fast vacuum-based train system while companies such as Virgin Hyperloop in Nevada and Transport in Canada have been experimenting with the idea. India is spearheading the global Hyperloop research with full government backing and commercial intent. India's ambitious vision has caught the attention of global players. In March 2022, Tudor Swiss American Enterprise, Tudor Hyperloop, incubated at IIT Madras, signed an MOU backed by both Swiss and oh, Indian governments. All of them have come forward and given their, uh, you know, uh, infrastructure uh, support in terms of we need a lot of steel, we need a lot of... So when will this be able to be tested? That's what I want to know when it's going to be able to be tested to, and see how it does. And that's, that's what I want to, because I'm truly, truly fascinated and now I'm intrigued. And I'd love to, to see it at work. Construction and stuff like that. So with all these things, this 422 meter track has come up and it is Asia's uh, first global hyperloop competition has happened. India is one of the handful countries currently making progress on building a Hyperloop that's fit for commercial use. The first successful test of a Hyperloop vehicle in Europe has been carried out at the European Hyperloop Center in the Netherlands. China state-owned China Aerospace Science and Industry Cooperation is developing a high-speed magnetic levitation transportation system a Canadian company, Transport, is refining levitation technologies and Hyperloop One, formerly Virgin Hyperloop, was a US transportation technology company that worked to commercialize high-speed travel. It has since shifted its focus to freight applications. Additionally, Indian Railways and IIT Madras are collaborating on vertical takeoff and landing vehicle, further expanding India's dominance in futuristic transport technologies. As the world searches for sustainable, ultra-fast travel solutions, all eyes are on India for leading the change into the future. Ragini Sudhir Chauri for DD India. Dang, that is truly, truly just freaking amazing to me. Like, um, shout out India. Uh, the innovation is crazy. Uh, I'm so freaking excited for this to be tested, for this to be functioning. Like... That Hyperloop is going to be an absolute world changer. A world changer. That's all we got. If you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to subscribe. And give me your thoughts in the comment section. Give the video a thumbs up. Check out the next one. And I'll see y'all.